What is going on everybody? Today I am really excited to show you the cleanest 2015 Newmar King Air that I have ever seen. And my buddy Eddie, the manager at the Motor Coach store here said that this is the cleanest 2015 motorhome he has ever seen. This coach only has 10,000 miles and is absolutely in the wrapper. And I've talked about it in other videos that I think that silver, black, and white are the best colors for resale value. And the interior of this coach is absolutely in the wrapper as well. So let's take a closer look at this Newmark King Air. This is on the Spartan K3 chassis with the Cummins 600. I love the stainless down the side of the coach. You've got lots of little details like the fade in the paint job. It goes from a white to a silver to a gray. You'll notice that the paint scheme comes through the slide rooms. It's got the big Girard awnings up top, frameless windows, power awnings over the windows. It's just loaded with equipment. But before we go inside, let's open the basement bays up real quick. It's loaded with equipment. When we go into the first bay here, you're gonna see it's got the Dometic cooler on a slide tray all super clean and those of you that have been following the channel for a long time know i'm a detail guy i love to see that power washer here in the front bay making it easy to get those bugs scrubbed off the front of the coach and talking about the front of the coach i want to show you guys something real quick the king air has a lot of cool little features like the wiper blades are tucked down underneath this front cap here that's going to keep them out of the sun giving them more uv protection and then they're not catching any road debris while you're going down the road and i love the king King Air badging on this coach is really a, just a style that's way ahead of its time. So the second bay here is gonna have a power storage tray that does have a button that you can just press to open that out. It's got a thousand pound carrying capacity and then this little tailgate that will open and close. Looks like they've got some extra tiles, some extra goodies. Here's the extra chairs for the dinette that we're gonna see inside in a moment. And again, a power storage tray with this button. And I like the placement of this button. You're able to kind of see what's going on while you press the button. Again, a thousand pound uh, carrying capacity. This next bay is gonna have a manual slide tray. It looks like a little Numar uh, blanket there. You've got the Dirt Devil Central Vac. Here's your exterior entertainment with a Sony TV JBL soundbar. And these wheels and tires are just glowing. Uh, Michelin tires with date codes of 2021. So now if you go on the motorcoachstore.com, you'll be able to get all the photographs, the check-in sheet, the build sheet, all of the equipment on this coach. So if for some reason I missed something in this video, you can always go to that website and see all that information there. So we got the uh, DEF tank there. And then one of the things I like about the King Air, when we press this little lever right here, the rear engine hatch is gonna open up. Then you've got your Cummins 600. This has a 20,000 pound towing capacity, 600 horsepower, it's the ISX. We've got the plumbing bay, manifold system, macerator toilet, power hose reel, outside shower, your tank rinses. You've got your tank monitors outside. Here you have a 50 amp power cord reel your Oasis hydronic heating system. That's gonna be a 50,000 BTU system. And then here's the other side of your full pass-through bays. And then you've got your Xantrax inverters here. And then your battery bank up front with those 88D house batteries. Electronics bay up front. And then here's the switch for the 12.5 Onan diesel generator. So as we go into the coach, it's got the code entry. I love the Numar emblem on the grab handle here. So up front in the cockpit area, this is just in the wrapper. 2015, this styling is way ahead of its time with the carbon fiber steering wheel. You've got the carbon fiber dash, cup holders, your gear selector for your Allison 4000 series transmission. This has the Hadley NDHWH leveling controls. You've got your cameras here, monitors, simple AC controls. You can start and stop your generator here. 
a step cover for your passenger that comes completely flush, making it a little more comfortable for your passenger. You've got your shade controls up here. This does have the comfort drive as well, so you can adjust the firmness of the steering. And with 600 horsepower, only 10,000 miles on this coach, this is a delight to drive. So if you need to tow a 20,000 pound trailer, this is a way to do it in style, especially for this price point. But this interior is absolutely in the wrapper. I love the cream colors with the diamond stitching on all of the seating throughout the coach. You've got the three 15,000 BTU AC units up top with this nice aesthetic piece and then the way the air conditioning is ducted in this coach it takes the sound down a lot right now we're running the ACs on a hot Florida day and it's still very quiet so going through the coach you're gonna have a little bit of a uh, storage here below your love seat love that diamond stitching and then we do have a TV on a televator very quiet how that goes up and I love to point out the window balances here, it's like a perforated leather. Above the TV and the televator, you've got a little bit of storage where you can house your components. It's got the wine guard, the track vision, Sony receiver there, Blu-ray player. Then on the other side here, I really like this floor plan with the kind of L-shaped couch here. Then you got a little spot to set your arms. And then we're gonna have the booth style here. So a lot of seating if you wanna entertain in this coach. And I don't even wanna sit on this so clean. You can tell that the previous owners really took good care of this. Now, one thing that I'm really excited about in this coach is these floors. In 2015, this style of floor was way ahead of its time. Really something that you're gonna see in late model motorhomes. This coach really has a timeless design in it. And these are all heated floors as well. So as we go into the booth, area here this will swivel actually if I come over to the other side I can just press a button when the slide rooms come in you're probably gonna put that table in but you can adjust it out as well as up and down so depending on how big you are you can have plenty of room I've got the table up and out right now and you can see plenty of room here but very comfortable too you can see that TV in the front of the coach you can see the TV on the televator and I like the way this is curved just a comfortable feeling this is a really cool accent wall right here they've got that same accent wall in, in the kitchen there and as we come into the galley I've got to point out the style of this backsplash with that accent lighting really cool style countertop with the sink covers that match this countertop it's got the edge with a little lip here so that if anything spills it's not going to drip down on the cabinet faces. And then when we take these sink covers off, check out the sinks inside of this coach. Super high-end kitchen sink. Then you've got your true induction cooktop, your GE Avantia microwave, little storage up top here. Actually pretty deep storage. And then when we open up all of the cabinets, you're gonna see plenty of storage in this galley little pull-out drawer here with the dovetail construction. You've got a Fisher Paykel dishwasher, lots of drawer space. It's gonna be a silverware drawer with the silverware dividers in it. Little spot for a trash can uh, below the sink there and lots of drawer space. Big deep drawers in this coach. Then coming through the coach, we've got a Whirlpool residential refrigerator with a water and ice dispenser. You've got a pull-out pantry, all dovetail construction on the pantry drawers there. More storage up here with Bose speakers in the cabinet there. So we've got the half bathroom with this swiveling door so that when the slide rooms come out, it's easy to get into this bathroom. You do have a window, those same beautiful tile floors go into the bathroom. We've got the same style countertops with a little ledge. So if something does spill, it's not gonna spill on that countertop face. You've got the central vac, beautiful backsplash. And then coming back into the rear bedroom, we've got this big double door and that's got the nice inlay in the doors. But the thing I wanna point out is as we come through this coach, because this is a, a triple full wall slide right here, we have a wider entry into this bedroom. And this is a very luxurious feel. The headboard back there, you've got windows on both sides of the bed. Even the bedding in this coach just has a real luxurious feel to it. You do have storage overhead for your throw pillows or whatnot. And then I wanna point out the way the King Air styling is, you have this puck lighting and this piece that comes over your bed, but then the cabinets are recessed 
pressed back there. So giving it a very luxurious feel. And then you've got all kinds of controls. You can control your awnings, your lights, your generator, all while you're laying in bed. And then you've got a little bit of countertop space on both sides of the bed. And then in your bedroom, you have a Sony TV, a Bose stereo. You can monitor your tanks, control your AC, DC, gen set, water, your floor heat, all from this little panel right here. And then you've got a good amount of drawer space in your closet as well. Again, all dovetail construction on these drawers. Now the big highlight of this coach is this huge rear bathroom. So high end, so far ahead of its time. You can see it's got the same beautiful floors that we saw through the coach. These bowls are something we're gonna see in the brand new $2 million motorhomes. A huge shower here. I'll do the shower test for you guys. It's got this nice teak seat. A beautiful tile here. Now I'm gonna to be totally honest, I'm 6'2", and I'd have to put the shower at a little bit of an angle. Now I do have my shoes on in the shower here too, so that may affect it a little bit. I don't know, it could be a little bit taller, but then there's a second shower head too, so I could, I could definitely make this work. But I think that's what I would have to do. I'd just have to sit down on this nice teak seat, take a shower while sitting down in this coach, but beautiful tile work. You've got the glass shower door. They're all very high end. Little latch to keep that in place. Here you've got storage next to your shower with adjustable shelving and then a washer and dryer, Whirlpool stackable washer and dryer in the back of the coach. Then I love these leather panels that are the inlay on the closet doors back here. Cedar closet. And then you've got a safe back here, little shoe cubbies. Super clean in this coach. And then your Tecma toilet and another vent with a fan. So this coach just got here to the Motor Coach Store in Bradenton, Florida, and is available for $499,999. If you're a serious buyer, you can contact Bradley Twait. His information is at themotorcoachstore.com. I greatly appreciate all of you that are subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again.